Buongiorno amici, buongiorno Hi guys, Senta, welcome to a new wonderful walking tour from the city of Padova We are here in the center of the city in the square called Prato della Valle Very nice, you see here a lot of people around the running families enjoying this wonderful Sunday of November, a little bit cold today but we will go around and discover the city of Padova it's a big city so we will divide in two parts this is the first part and don't miss guys also the second part of uh, the city and with this video we will go here from Prato della Valle to the Basilic di Sant'Antonio to the Abbazia di San Giustina we will visit a market, a farmer market which is here in Prato della Valle and I hope you will enjoy the video and you will subscribe to the channel where we have videos from everywhere around Italy so andiamo amici the Loggia Amulea just here in Prato della Valle very nice bells are ringing down there there is the Basilica di Sant'Antonio where we will go in this video And the Padova, remember guys, it's a city where you will have a lot to see. There are also some sites which they are UNESCO heritage sites like the Orto Botanico and the paintings of uh, the chapel of uh, Scrovegni where there are the paintings of Giotto and then also around the city many beautiful things to see starting from the Basilica di Sant'Antonio to the Abbazia di San Giustina so a lot a lot to see
So now from here let's go to the market, the farmer's market down there where there are these white uh, tendas and then we go to see the, see the Abbazzi of San Giustina. Here, as you can see, they are already preparing for the Christmas uh, time, so they are putting the lights on the trees, decorating the city, so that we look even more beautiful for, for Christmas. And now that it's uh, uh, 11 o'clock, 11 o'clock in the morning, you see people are starting to come, walk around the city and spend the day in Padova. So guys, especially if you come here in uh, autumn or winter time, it's very common to find uh, such a local market here with uh, all farmers from the area which they come, they bring their food for selling. And all of them, they're very tasty, high quality and local products. Thank you. 
Wow guys, look at the church of San Giustina, amazing, really beautiful, it's from the 10th century, so now let's go inside and discover this beautiful church.
other thing it's a chapter has his own name so this is the chapter of the holy innocence super nice chapel of Pietà with these wonderful sculptures the Basilica di San Giustino in Padova. Wow, look how wonderful it is, guys. Many frescoes all around on the walls, on the roof. So the best option when you are visiting such big churches with so many things to see is to come here with a guide so they will explain you everything.
this was the only package of some new print. Until with one euro coin, you will get all the informations about the different chapels of the church, the sculptures, the history. So you will get a little bit more insight also on the history of this wonderful church here in Padova.
So guys, now from here let's uh, walk to the Orto Botanico, which is UNESCO Heritage Side, and then to the Basilica di Sant'Antonio. From here you see right side the Orto Botanico or straight the Basilica di Sant'Antonio. We go first to the Orto Botanico.
diris the entrance of the Orto Botanico UNESCO site. So guys, now we are inside the Orto Botanico. Uh, so when uh, you go, you pay 10 euro, and then you get this uh, ticket with a map of the Orto Botanico, which they will explain you where to go, the different uh, areas of the garden. And it's uh, nice to work here in, the, in this green area of Padova, it's just here in the center of the city, at few walking minutes from Sant'Antonio or from Prato della Valle. So now let's walk a little bit on the green of this UNESCO heritage site. So each tree, each plant has this label with a name the species Oh, this is a magnolia, sempre verde tree from the year 1786. Incredible. Uh, look here from here you see the, the roof of Sant'Antonio with a golden statue on the top so just understand how close you are to the Basilica di Sant'Antonio and here another wonderful tree
another piece of history of this garden here 1750 from China called Jingo the palma the dirt So in the Palma they keep it in this uh, room at a controlled temperature so they can keep the temperature and humidity as well at a certain level. Well, it's incredible how many types of uh, trees and plants there are and they are living all together just separate from by a stone one to from the other and then they all stay together here in this garden And now with the colors of the autumn it's wonderful but it must be very nice also in spring when everything will turn green and flowers around and the birds singing it's something also very nice to see the meta sequoia coming from china here it doesn't say the year
più profondo il prezzo. Questa volta dentro le piante che sono tutte esotiche sono organizzate secondo un criterio moderno. Cioè qui dentro sono stati ricostruiti alcuni biomi terrestri. So here it's the biodiversity room where there are all trees coming from different areas of the planet at the controlled temperature and the humidity just to keep the plants alive. very hot and the humid inside here but a very nice and intense smell of nature
as you can see there are different areas of uh, the garden with the different temperature and in each area they replicate some different environmental Palma di vetro 12 metri 500 
poi di tutto c'è dal bar qualcosa di nuovo, quello da cui stavano lontano, probabilmente era ancora qualche ora per cui stare Allegra! Aspetta, no? Guarda, ma che bello! Non può, non può!
price here 1680 platano orientale and here it's the exit of uh, the Orto Botanico so to visit the old garden really well and maybe with a guide it will take uh, at least one hour but it's a nice experience to visit this uh, garden UNESCO site just in the center of Palo Interreal, center of the city and for 10 euro I think it's uh, worth to come and uh, spend some time in this uh, green area of Padova Wow, so this was the tour of uh, uh, Orto Botanico and from here you see the Basilica of Sant'Antonio, it's very near we see already the roof and here it's well indicated Prato della Valle on the left side and the Basilica del Santo on the right side Grazie a tutti. 
And finally here we are in Piazza del Santo and here the magnificent Basilic of the Saint Basilica del Santo. So let's go. And this is the Basilic also from the inside. guys also here if you want to sleep just uh, in front of uh, the Basilica di Sant'Antonio here there is hotel Hotel Donatella will leave you in the uh, description below the link for booking this uh, hotel so you know also where to stay when you will come in Padova Here it's the line and the tomb of uh, Sant'Antonio. So a lot of people they come and they stand in line to wait to get their time in front of the saint.
So guys, uh, this was a walking tour from uh, Padova, from uh, the beautiful uh, square of Prato della Valle to here to the Basilic of Sant'Antonio. So and this is just the first part of uh, uh, Padova, so if you want to see the rest you can uh, also look for the second part of uh, uh, the city of Padova where we will show you the rest of this amazing amazing city so thanks to everybody for watching grazie a tutti amici and don't forget to subscribe to uh, send some likes some comments if you want and thanks again guys for watching ciao a tutti amici and that's you soon with another video. Ciao ciao!